we've learned how to post and uh, how to reply. So now we're actually going to um, go a bit further and learn how to um, edit a post, how to put a tag on it, and how to delete our post. Now what I notice sometimes, a lot of students, when the first page opens, it comes up on latest posts. So if you actually want to talk in a group, you need to go to the group section, which is here. So we're going to go to the Chroma Hospitality. Now the first thing I'm going to show you is um, how to edit a post. So first of all, I'm just going to type in anything. It doesn't really matter for the um, demonstration. I'm going to send that to the Chroma Hospitality group. That comes up there. Now what I realize after I've posted, either I've spelt it wrongly or I want to change it. Now if it's my post, I can actually change that. So, and click there on edit post. And then I can actually put something else, better post, and then save. Now the next thing is, I've decided, no, I don't like this post at all. Um, so I'm actually going to delete and click on the delete. Click OK, and that's gone. Now, another cool feature of Edmodo uh, for students is you can actually link to this post. And what that means, if you click the link, each post has a unique URL. And you actually can post it into another web page. Now, the easiest way is to click View Post Link. That opens up another page. Now, this is handy if you decide, hey, I want to print off what's been going in class. There are so many different posts flying back and forth. And you can lose that um, information very, very quickly. So the tagging um, function is really, really handy to actually keep a track of all of the different assignments. Now remember, we actually have learned how to filter our post. This is another way of tagging um, just for you. So you'll notice here, here is a tag, here is a presentation tag. So what I'm going to do is show you how to tag. Here's another presentation. Now, this is the tag feature here. Click that. And I've already got one tag that I've already written. So I'll put that's tag presentation. Now let's say this post here. I'm going to do another tag. This comes in handy if you want to keep track of assignments or a particular post with information that you need and you tag it whichever way you want. So a new tag and just going to put in important. Now you ask, so what? How is that going to help me? Before I get there, if you don't want to tag it anymore, you can click that X and that will actually delete it. So again, I'm going to re-tag it with important. Now up at the top, you'll find a drop-down box called My Tags. Now, the first one I can click on Presentations. What, will, what it will do, no matter how long the data stream is, is actually bring in all of my presentations all at once. Remember, if you want to go back to the main page, you must close the tag first. Now, the other great thing about this is you'll see Shared Tags. Now, I keep a assignment tag, I put those tags on, and that will also help you keep track of the different things. So I hope that's helpful. Thank you for listening.